right friends welcome back to learning space this is english made simple series this is the 14th module as usual we are going to discuss 8 to 10 words followed by a small part of the passage let us look at the words the first word is albatross this is the name of a white bird which lives near the areas of pacific and south atlantic oceans and more than this there is one important meaning of albatross look at the common man like you and me we can go to roadside restaurant we can have lunch we can have a cup of tea or coffee but the celebrities they cannot go to roadside restaurant subsequently huge crowd may assemble and may block the roads so it prevents them to lead normal life under those circumstances you can use this word albatross that means something you want to be free from look at the example name and fame becomes an albatross for several celebrities because they cannot lead normal life just like a common man so it is preventing them to lead a normal life so they want to free from this under those circumstances you can use albatross look at the next word i would like to explain the difference between this auxiliary and ancillary these two words quite often in the news auxiliary let us look at auxiliary that means look at some specialist some world famous heart specialist is there in some hospital he must be supported by auxiliary staff that means the help or support he require he is the most important person he should be supported by support staff and they are called auxiliary staff so the world famous cancer specialist must be supported by auxiliary staff here you see there is a shortage of skilled auxiliary staff in corporate hospitals so auxiliary means giving the help or support without help or support this world class cancer specialist cannot work so such type of staff are called auxiliary staff the other word i would like to explain is ancillary ancillary means some main industry is there main factory is there there are around 7 8 ancillary plants another example if you see apollo group the main aspect of apollo group is corporate hospitals but this pharmaceutical units diagnostic units these are all called ancillary units or you can say these are ancillary as far as apollo group is concerned so there is a lot of difference between auxiliary support staff helping staff and this is of course auxiliary cooling system sometimes which comes into play when it is required and ancillary ancillary means main industry supporting ancillaries one example i told you that is about apollo group of hospitals they are having thousands of pharmacies so these pharmacies and diagnostic centers you can call them ancillary units right look at the next one wistfulness sometimes you may carry a slight sadness when you think about your childhood when you think about your golden days in your life in anybody's life there are some golden days and of course childhood is very very important because of innocence when you think about childhood when you think about your good olden days you may carry some feeling of slight sadness that means you may be thinking that those days were better and we passed those days if we get those days it would be better such type of feeling in your mind that is wistfulness that means a feeling of sadness because you are thinking about something that is impossible or in the past you were good old in days you are talking about but they cannot come back and returning to the childhood innocence is mere wistfulness in reality you cannot get that under those circumstances you can use wistfulness look at the next word appalling appalling i gave you two examples very bad shocking if you look at the conditions inside the prisons in india 
in several of the prisons in india the conditions are shocking and in india prisoners are kept in the most appalling conditions that means very bad really shocking another example is in several government offices of course there may be some government offices which are exceptions but in several government offices the upkeep of the files that is appalling very bad shocking and look at the next word incarcerate there are two meanings of incarcerate that means keeping somebody in prison that is incarceration and as far as indian prisons are concerned around 70% of the prisoners they are not convicts in fact conviction is yet to be given to them they are under trial prisoners another meaning of incarcerate is please recollect around 3 4 months ago there is earthquake in turkey syria and in turkey syria earthquake thousands of people were incarcerated in the damaged houses for several hours in fact some people were retrieved after 4 5 days also because there was huge rubble because of earthquake and under that rubble several children were trapped and after 3 4 days they were taken out and such type of condition is also called incarceration in addition to keeping somebody in prison granular granular means in detail granular details means you are going into each and every item you see bizus is into trouble now the company is in deep trouble and to put the company back on track that means to keep the company into good health once again it requires granular details about its functioning finer details in detail one has to go and investigate what went wrong so therefore it is finely detailed and granular another example i have given normally if you look at cmd or ceo they don't look at granular details they look at aggregates granular means going into each and every simple item when some company is into problems you have to look at each and every simple item that is the important aspect and another word is aggregate it is by adding together all small small things normally cmd or ceo look at aggregates but not granular things now it is very clear to you so galaxy is an aggregation of stars and dust there are several stars dust everything put together that is aggregates of stars and dust that is galaxy and another example through the decennial census that means through the population census which are held once in 10 years decennial census means once in 10 years we get aggregated data how many percentage of women are there what is the percentage of education what is the population of scheduled caste all these aggregate data you get but not granular data pertaining to each and every individual a gravit to make a bad situation worse i am talking about three words granular data aggregate data and now a gravit already the situation is bad sometimes what happens the cancer patients health they may aggravate once the chemotherapy or radiotherapy is started so the treatment for the cancer further aggravates the condition already it is in bad situation and look at another example somebody is suffering from lung related problems and when such dust is there because of construction all of you are well aware construction dust will have pm10 particulate matter 10 predominantly and pm2.5 also when such particles are there more in the environment already the patient is suffering from lung related diseases his condition may be aggravated bad situation may become worse right friends we learned several words and now look at a small part of the passage this is 20th september editorial in the hindu with record to india canada ties please recollect nature he was killed in canada 
and Canada is making wild allegations against India with regard to India's hand and now the situation became worse and the relations which were not in good stead for the past several years they got worsened they have gone to too low and here you can learn some of the words meanings and how to follow a passage India and Canada stare stare at it down turn you are staring at something means you are staring at some bad situation then only you have to use staring at something staring at a downturn in ties staring at a bad situation after trudeau's charges canadian prime minister made wild allegations of india's hand that's why the ties they are going to be too low that means expectation is india canada ties are staring at further deterioration canada prime minister made startling allegations startling means very surprising sometimes worrying very surprising allegations why it is called very surprising because when a country is making wild allegations against another country by referring to or by pointing to your hand in the killing of kalistani activist in canada that's why startling allegations surprising allegations tying the killing of canadian kalistani leader in june to agents of the government of india and he is continuing marks a new low in their unraveling ties unraveling means something is not good that means things are not that good and that is now made open under those circumstances you have to use unravel that means this india canada ties for the past several decades you can say since 1980s because india carries some impression that canada is giving host to khalistani elements please recollect 1985 kanishka bombing and india carries the depression so the relations are ties are not in good stead and now unraveled this is exposed now new low in their unraveling ties mr trudeau's accusation he said evidence had been shared with india had been shared and also raised in a bilateral meeting with prime minister last weekend has a set of a chain of events previously he used to had because already trudeau said that he shared that means some past event we are talking about and now has a set of various events now expelling the diplomats and rejecting the visas stopping visas all these that's why he told has a set of a chain of events chain of events right and now the diplomatic mission size is reduced from around 60 to 20 that is the latest news report after canada expelled expel means all of you are well aware a senior indian diplomat india summoned the canadian high commissioner india summoned summon means by government order you are calling somebody by government order that is summoning it may be by court it may be by government and expelled expelled from the country canada's station chief the united states and australia partners with canada in the five eyes intelligence sharing agreement have expressed deep concerns over the issue have expressed previously he used had that means he was referring that means the trudeau's statement in fact as trudeau said he was referring to some past things that's why he used had but now he is talking about he is linking with the present that's why have expressed that is used so there is a lot of difference when had is used have is used so when something is linked that is in this sense it is expressed have expressed here also has a set of right so when in the passage has set of have expressed that means some issue is linked with the present this concludes the 14th module please do join for 15th module have a nice day thank you